What is going on everybody? This is Mike with Terrible Gaming and today I am playing some Subnautica. I have uh, had a lot of people tell me this is a really fun game. I have not played it yet. I've had it installed for months. Um, but yeah, as you can see, I don't even have a new save or anything started yet. Uh, so we're going to go ahead and just give it a give it a shot here. And Oh my gosh, I don't know. Uh, survival, Freedom, Hardcore. Uh, let's do... Um, you know, let's do freedom. No, you know, oh, never mind. Just kidding. Yeah, we'll do freedom. There's no hunger or thirst, apparently, so that'll probably be helpful. Probably a good idea that I picked the uh, no hunger or thirst route. I can barely manage those in real life, so. Press any button to continue. All right, good start. Oh, I'm controlling it now. Okay. Um, let's go up. Nope, I don't go up. Um, oh, here we go. Fire extinguisher. Left mouse button. Okay, cool. Um, how, there we go. Okay, figured it out. Firefighting simulator. I mean, I barely almost died. <laughs> right out the gates. Oh, man. Greetings, survivor. Great job not dying. To well, thank you. In further survival in emergency situations, you have been issued this personal data assistant. The interface visible now will organize your inventory. Display currently available construction blueprints and holds other valuable information. Please take a moment to familiarize yourself with it. Okay, very good. Um, lots of blueprints for stuff. Cool. Uh, voice log. Okay, sure. Why not? Oh, I don't do that. Okay. Time T plus three hours since planet four. Life pod hull, secure, communications, offline. Okay, now how do I get out of this? Tap? Okay, there we go. Alright. The Aurora suffered catastrophic hull failure. Cause, unknown. Zero human life signs detected in 100 meter range. Well... That's not, that's not great. Okay, let's go back in. Um, use repair tool. Do I have a repair tool? Um, no, I, I don't, I, I don't think so. Okay. Uh, use fabricator. Resources. Okay. That's how you build stuff. Med cabinet. Okay, there's nothing in there apparently. Uh, container. Oh, I store stuff in here, I guess. Oh, no, this is the storage. Okay. I'm just going to take everything. That's not how I get out. I need to stop doing that. Okay. Uh, self charging power cells. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Escape pod, fine. All right, well, let's, let's exit through the bottom here. Ooh. Let's see what this is. Okay, salt deposit, sweet. Some debris. More debris? Yep. Oh, tried to catch it. Not quick enough. Environment, uncharted, ocean planet, oxygen, nitrogen, atmosphere, water contamination, high. 
Oxygen. Ooh. Okay, apparently I need to pay attention to my oxygen, which I was not doing. Alright, let's go back inside. Can I build anything now? I mean, I know I only got like three things, so, um... Let's look at this. Okay, metal salvage. Okay. Salt deposit, sure. Um, blueprints. What do we need for the repair tool? I don't even know what that looks like. Flare, survival knife. I probably want that. Um, repair tool. There we go. Uh, magnesium. Okay. Life pods are equipped with a fabricator. Programmed to construct tools and render yes. organic substances edible. Okay, I just I need to go get more resources. Um, let's see. Ooh, that thing looks big. I'm gonna stay away from that. Quartz, cool. Is there a fast swim option? I don't know. Detecting increased local radiation levels. Trend is consistent with ongoing degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core due to damage. Hey, okay. found a fish. Zero collision. Continuing to monitor. New creature discovered. Cool. More stuff. More salvage. More salvage. Salt deposits. Um, uh, this is just a creepy environment in general. Oh, I'm going way far away. Let's go closer before a giant alien fish swallows me alive. Or some other terrible thing rips out my skeleton. So let's go ahead and go in here. I think I probably need to store some stuff. Uh, let's store all that stuff for now. Uh, I don't even remember what I needed. Um, I need magnesium and crash fish sulfuric powder. And I hit escape again. Because I'm great at learning stuff. So, let's see what this is. Picked up a lead, which I mean, probably super safe. Acid mushrooms. That's like, that sounds like a party right there. Acid mushrooms. Um, Let's look in this cave that's probably going to result in my death because, oh, I don't have any more oxygen. Let's go back up to the surface and then we'll explore the cave. And a lot, there it is. Okay. Uh, more quartz. Ooh, that thing is weird looking. I should probably turn around because I'm going to get too far into here and uh, drown. Uh oh. Okay, this this way. Yeah, there's lots of fabricating I need to do, but I, I, I don't have... I don't have the resources for it. Okay. Let's try not to drown. Ooh, here we go. Here's some shiny looking stuff. Oh my gosh, I'm so far underneath the water. Um, yeah, let's go to this green thing. It's a creature egg. Probably shouldn't have taken that. But that's okay. 
Ooh, I hope it's not that thing's egg. That thing will murder me. I'm going to go a little bit closer to it because I want to know what this is. Okay, it is nothing, apparently. At least nothing yet. Oh, gosh. There's so much scary stuff happening right now. As if it wasn't bad enough that I'm in this gigantic ocean. Um, it's becoming nighttime, and... That's just... That's not a good thing for me. Okay, so let's see. Fabricator. Ooh, I can make glass. Titan... Oh, can I actually make... Oh, I can make magnesium. I need the salt deposits. Oh, okay, well that's easy enough. I've already got two of them. Um, what else did I need? I needed some weird thing that I don't see in here. Ooh, oxygen tanks. Which I do need the glass. Well, that's pretty cool. Alright, I need glass. What else did I need? Two titanium. Cool. Oh my gosh, look at that. I actually accomplished something. Okay. So how do we... Oh, it's already equipped, I think. I think I have more oxygen than I did before. Um, let's see. So I don't know what to do with this creature egg. Um, let's... Oh, jeez. For the fourth time this episode, I've hit escape instead of tab. At Terrible Gaming, I like to be as professional as possible. And uh, I like to just make sure that hitting a button multiple times doesn't do something different the next time. So that's all I'm doing. And I'm just getting a ton of titanium right now because that seems like a good thing to do. Oh, I can get an ingot. Let's do that. Um, and then let's make some more glass. And let's actually, let's see... So I can make another tank, I can make some pipes. Um, radiation suit. I can make a beacon. Gravisphere. Gravisphere. Or Gravisphere. Whatever. Uh, tools. So... This is exactly the same stuff as what was in my menu. So let's actually, let's go in here real quick. Let's see. Uh, okay, so I got the tank on me here. I don't know what goes in this spot, but then I can have shoes apparently. Microchips embedded in my skull maybe. That's what that might be. Um, and then we can do... I don't know. I don't know what any of this stuff is. So... Again, perfect. Okay, so we can probably just store all this stuff. Oh, I probably might want the fire extinguisher, even though I'll be underwater. I have a feeling I might need it. Knowing me, I'll end up lighting the ocean on fire. Okay, so that'll do do that. Um, how long is it nighttime? Can I sleep? Oh, I don't have a bed. I just pretty much have a chair. That seems to be not in good shape. Uh, okay, I just need, I really badly need a repair tool. It's pretty much what I've come down to. Continued degradation of the Aurora's dry pool. May cause a quantum detonation. Calculating risk assessment. Death by malnourishment, 7%. By physical injury, 11%.
by exposure to radioactive crash site materials, 19%. If the drive core is breached, probability of death increases to 65%. Jeez. Okay, looks like it is daytime now. So I feel less scared to go in here. Oh, that thing doesn't look super friendly. Let's go touch it. I'm sure it's... I'm sure it's fine. We need whatever that thing... Will, oh, gosh. So many scary noises down here. Oh gosh, oh no. I have made a huge mistake. 30 seconds. I'm so far away too. I'm so <laughs> uh, Okay. Oh, there it is. Oh no, that's something else. That's something else horrifying. Uh, where'd my boat go? Or my death pod. Wonderful. That was enjoyable. I'm glad that I'm doing this. Okay, let's see. Okay. I need three salt deposits, and I think I actually have more salt deposits in here. Salt deposit. Salt deposit. Okay, cool. Uh, let's get out of here. Ooh, I hit the right button that time. That was nice. Uh, magnesium. Score. Okay. Uh, so let's go to tools. What else did I need? So I have, I need the titanium and then crash fish sulfuric powder, which I don't know what that means or where to find that. Um, let's see. Maybe advanced materials. Maybe I just need to pick up one of those fish. That's what it kind of sounds like. Uh, you know, maybe I should make some more of those ingots so I can kind of compress these things. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. Yell at me in the comments if it's bad. Crafting, crafting, crafting. I think I can only make one. Oh no, I could make two. All right. There we go. I really want to know what this does. Can I put this in my like hot bar? Plant it somewhere? Have my own pet creature? That would be cool. Okay, so let's go try and capture a fish. Okay, I want that one. Come here, friend. And I can't capture them. I picked up a Gary fish. I don't think that that's what I need. Gosh, there's so many noises. Oh, it's probably that horrifying thing. I'm gonna go ahead and swim away from it. Because I think it wants to eat my flesh. Why are these things so close to my initial base? That's, that's not fair. Uh, maybe... This weird looking thing? Bladder fish. That's not right. May have unexpected characteristics and applications. Utilizing alien resources is a proven survival strategy. Good. 
Oh, there's another egg. I think. Yeah, creature egg. Yep. Some more salvage. Hmm. Oh, well, that wasn't good. Oh, and I died. Sounds about right. I touched a thing and died. Okay, well, at least I'm not that far behind. I have all my titanium, which is good. Oh, this is my storage. I don't want to take that out of my storage. Okay. There we go. Okay, well, I died. Um, I, you know, made some ingots. Uh, I think we're kind of on our way to making a couple of tools, which would be nice. Um, and, uh, yeah, I mean, overall, it's been a pretty uh, pretty successful episode, I think. Nice start to the, uh, to the game. Uh, I don't have much to show for it except for this destroyed pod here. But I am really enjoying playing this, so I'm thinking that I probably will do a few more episodes of this. Um, if you guys are enjoying it. Uh, let me know. Oh gosh. Readings exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the Aurora's dark matter drive core. Uh huh. The quantum detonation will occur with a probability of 85.5 percent. Wow, that doesn't Advisor sound good. A one kilometer safety range. Okay, well that was a that was a pleasant uh, little interruption there. But uh, anyways, if you guys are enjoying this this video, uh, let me know in the comments. Uh, like the video too. Uh, subscribe to our channel for more content, um, and until next time, I've been Mike with Terrible Gaming, and you have yourself a terrible day. Thank you so much for watching and supporting our channel. If you enjoyed this video, click right here for our latest upload, or click right here for another episode, and click our channel icon in the middle to subscribe.